this is Gülay Özkan. Uh, currently, we are at the Webit Congress in Istanbul. Uh, I'm with uh, Shadi Alyaski and also Adam Movafti uh, from uh, Vasani, which is a, a traffic application. We all know that I mean, you are from uh, Cairo. Yes. And uh, also, I know that I've been in Cairo. And I know, yeah, I've experienced the, the traffic It's there. Very crowded. Also, yeah, and also we have a huge traffic problem here. So I'm really curious about your application. So how does your application work? Well, basically our application uh, uses uh, uh, people reports, or I mean user reports. Uh, uh, it's crowdsourced. So basically the user should access the application in order to add a, a manual report or automated report. Those are the two methods that we collect data from. Whenever you open the application, the application sends automatically to the server that you are in this specific road and you are moving with a specific speed. And then if, if this speed falls below uh, a threshold, we say that this uh, road is jammed or is it good or bad. That's how we detect it. Uh, the other method is using manual reports, which is one of the social parts of our application. That the user basically opens the app and takes a photo of the road and says that this road is jammed or it has uh, an accident, and then type a command and then post it to the application and share it within his social network. Uh, Adam, uh, you mentioned that the, uh, the government is currently, uh, I mean, embracing the application and also the police on the streets, they are using the application, right? Could you give some details? Uh, we didn't found a great help in Egypt from the government. Uh, when we were preparing for launching in Kuwait, uh, they uh, showed a great understanding and uh, great willing to uh, support us. They promised that they will install the application on all the officers in the street and to use the application and make uh, reports to help people. Also, the, we will have uh, access on the all uh, billboards in the streets that show the speeds. What's the current status of the application and what's your roadmap? Okay, uh, we just released a new version uh, this week. Uh, our older version was actually targeting only Egypt, uh, but the new version is, is targeting all over the world. Uh, currently, again, we are uh, targeting in, in our campaigns, uh, marketing campaigns, we are targeting Egypt and Kuwait. Uh, Kuwait is our new country that we just supported. Okay, uh, and uh, you mentioned that you look for partnership partners in, the, in these new countries that you are going to cover. So what type of partners you are looking for? Well, basically, as, as we have done uh, in Egypt, uh, that we, we have done kind of a sponsorship uh, with, with uh, Tsalot. Tsalot is, is one of the major uh, mobile operators in Egypt. Uh, so basically, uh, they do all, all our, our marketing campaigns in Egypt, and they do send targeted SMSs to the users that encourages them to download our app and install it and tell us their feedback. Uh, so, uh, actually, this is our, our main target, is, is to, to access every mobile user in this country. So, we are actually looking for a sponsorship with, with mobile operators, with anyone uh, capable of, of putting us in contact with, with all the users there, or all the people there. Okay. Adam, uh, you have been uh, in Istanbul for four days, right? How is the traffic here? Uh, traffic here uh, is not so good in uh, old Istanbul. But in New Istanbul, it's much better. I think uh, Istanbul needs it for a traffic application like Wasani, which will uh, help them to take shortcuts and something like that. And I think Wasani version 3, which uh, Shadi mentioned, will help Istanbul uh, to pass their uh, pain. Okay, then we look forward to seeing you soon here. Thank okay, you thank, thank you. Thank, thank you, you so very much. Bye-bye. Thank you, bye-bye.